All right, coming up next, it's a welterweight matchup between Tyron Woodley and Alan Chauvin. Our tale of the tape for this highly anticipated welterweight fight. So these fighters relatively close in age, just a year apart, with some differences in height and a similar reach. We send it inside the octagon. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds of the UFC welterweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 15 wins, six losses. He stands six feet tall, weighing in at 170 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Alan Bravo Chopin! And now with his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. A mixed martial artist holding a professional record of 18 wins, three losses, and one draw. He stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds, fighting out of St. Louis, Missouri, USA, Tyron, the chosen one, Woodley. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Dan Mergliotta. Dan Mergliotta, your referee. You ready? You ready? Let's go, fight. Round one. Just out of range with the big right hand. Woodley gets caught by the inside leg. Punches blocked. Woodley going for the body, targeting that area with the kick, but unable to land. Joban gets caught by the inside leg kick. Look at that jab, nice. Switching stances here. The kick lands. Nice inside leg kick. Tags him. Oh, now he has found his timing. He is doling out punishment here. Oh! Well, he leaned right into that hook shot, Joe, and that is certainly something that bears watching here moving forward. I know he's confident in his chin, but he's a sitting duck there walking right into the pocket to absorb that hook. Woodley gets hit with a kick. Nice punch by Chobin. Oh, good combination. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. He's really doing a good job of control. Oh! oh! He's out! Oh, he's out. He's out. A huge barrage of strikes. He kept coming and finally landed one big bomb for the knockout. Yeah, that right there is a high-level knockout, ladies and gentlemen. Crowd absolutely loving it. Just a perfect shot to end the fight. Landed flush. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming. So a huge, huge win for that young fighter here tonight. So there he is after a monumental knockout turned in here tonight. That is one they will be talking about for quite some time. We go inside the octagon where Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliotta has called a stop to this contest at one minute, 53 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by So just the way he drew it up here tonight, what a monumental moment and knockout to get his hand raised here tonight. He kept the judges out of it. He has certainly set himself up for a major opportunity here moving forward, but you can be sure tonight is about this knockout. He'll be celebrating deep into the night with his friends, his family, his coaches. Congratulations on a big KO tonight.